open the FTP program that I use, which is called Qt FTP, and you'll see that opening. So that's the first step. So in the directions that I sent you, you won't be using the, the um, page one because you've already done that. That's all about setting up the file. So now we're going on to page two. And I'm going to log in using the FTP program. And then I'll show you that. So now you should see the FTP program on the screen. It shows a bunch of files on the left and nothing on the right. Is that what you see? Okay. So then I put the file on my on my desktop, and here here it is where it says testing.csv, and you should see it right there where I'm wiggling the mouse. And then over here on the right, that's the server. So the left is my computer, and the right is the server. So I'm just going to click on it, and then I click the green button up here, and it uploads that file. And now you can see it over here on the right. So the right side is the server, so I put it on the server. So I'm done. I'm all finished with that. So I'm just going to close the FTP program. And now we go to the next part, which is we go to the admin. And then we're over here in, in system. And let's see, system. I go to import, export here, and then data flow, advanced, selecting that, and right here it's a, a demo server that we, we use where it's loaded with a bunch of other websites all on this demo server, and, and so it doesn't run as fast as it will once it's on the live server. programming code and the part I want to change is here where it says game console game console something dot CSV and I'm just going to change just that part not the brackets but just that part and I'm going to make it say testing because that's the name of the file that I uploaded so now it, in that space it says testing dot CSV yeah that's the only thing you change. And then we go save profile. And let's see that. That's it. Save profile, then after that we click run profile at the top left. Yeah, here I saved it, but now I have to go back. So there's run profile, and it's gonna. So it says make sure changes were saved, and it was. So now I'm gonna say run profile in a pop up, and you'll see it'll show what percent is done. So it says don't close the window during the import, and then it's processing. And it's saying the images don't exist. Right, and I thought they did exist. So unless, unless maybe they are no, no longer on the server since the day you sent it, maybe they've gotten rid of those images. No, you don't need to be 